Hello YouTube, this is Little Mr. Hardcore, aka Robert. This is a different view for now. But uh until I get settled in, I just moved. And they took forever to do my internet. They had to redo like every wire. Cause they said they were all bad, so it took them forever to get my internet back up. But I've been waiting and waiting and waiting and, and patiently waiting. On Father's Day, my wife picked this up for me. It's a huge box of autographs, baseballs, all kinds of stuff. I don't know what's all in there, but she bought this for me. Got a great deal, and so I finally get to go through it. I know there's some random stuff. I've, I heard of some of the random stuff, and I think they said there was 62 autograph baseballs in there. I think it was 62. I'm not for sure. But let's go through and see if I can name some of the stuff. That'd be great. But let's see what I got. Uh, first, we got these two. They must have gave these out at the game. Cavaliers autographs. This one, I don't know. Uh, this one is easy. It's Big Z. So that's pretty sweet. He got his numbered reti number retired. Uh, we got a... Uh, what is this? Doesn't say. It just says program for the Indians. Doesn't say what year. But it's the Indians versus Blue Jays, signed by Jake Westbrook. That's pretty sweet. We got a. Uh, I guess it's a. That's what they use it for. Just a giant bait, like a hanger baseball, signed by whoever that is. But I'm assuming almost all these are Indian. Okay, what's this one? Okay, here's a better one. It's this one. And, uh, some of the... Jake Westbrook was right there, but he's starting to get faded a little bit. Or John McDonald, I think is what his name is. Uh, that might... No, oh, I thought that was Brandon Phillips. It's not. That's Cliff Lee. Oh, well, there's that. I don't know anybody else, I don't think. Yeah, I don't think so. And then we got, what are these? Uh, oh, wait a minute, what's this? Uh, this looks just like a, a uh, oh, hold on, there's an autograph inside. How about that? This is uh, February 2004, February 9th, versus the Boston Celtics Cavaliers. And it's signed by... Bruno Sundolf. I have no clue who that is, but there he is. I don't know. Maybe I, I don't know if I missed any others, but it doesn't look like I did most of this. Is. What year is LeBron James' rookie year? I don't know. <laughs> that might be his rookie year book. Then we got, what are these? Some uh, sheets of cards, uncut cards from... 1992 front row. They're not in very good shape. This one's bent and these two are stuck together. But it has BJ Wallace, Chad Malata, Mike Tucker, Jason Giambi, Rick Helling, and Derek Jeter. That's right for the glare there, but there's Jeter and Giambi. But there, these two are stuck together and this one's got a big crease. But Jeter seems to be alright. I don't know nothing about those. And then we got, who's this? Brendan... Goggin, Gog, Goghan, signed uh, hero card, Marco Andretti, probably a member of the famous Andretti family, as I assume. Uh, oh, I remember this photo from a long time ago. This one looks like it's been beat up a little bit, but uh, this is an Omar Omar Vizquel, like he painted this photo it's just that's not his real signature down on the side that's just but it's o Omar Vizquel painted this photo of CC and then they gave out these photos and CC signed a bunch but it's signed by CC so there's that there's that picture frame here so this is what's his name ah did it say on it oh okay okay it says right there okay this is a in a frame, signed, Apollo Ono, got milk, 
add. So that's pretty sweet. Uh, uh, I don't know where this is from. I'll have to look it up. See if any, uh, maybe someone else knows. But here's what the logo looks like. One of those little ice cream helmets. Signed here. And it's signed there. I don't know either of these autographs. So there's an ice cream helmet signed by two players. And then we got... I did post this because it was laying on top. I did post this online. Signed uh, football. And they told me who it was, but I've already forgotten because I haven't had internet for a while. But it is a, a dual signed Jets football. Number... What's this guy's number 27 and number 22 for the 88 Jets, I'm assuming. But I don't know who they are. So there's that. Okay, let's get into what this is. Uh, there's two Indians mini helmets. I have no... Uh, I might, nope, I don't know anybody on this one. There's three guys. This one, this one. And then on this side, there's... I guess it would go this way. I don't know who that is either. I'll have to do some research. And I'm, I'm going to have to find two uh, mini helmet stands. Because there's also this one. This one's got a lot more... A lot more players on it, but I do see that on this one, Justin Masterson's right there. But I don't see, I don't know if anybody knows anybody else on any of this. Let me know, that'd be great. And if you need better, whoa, you need better pictures, I have no clue who any of these guys are. But there's that. Oh, here comes the fun part. There's baseballs everywhere. Okay, what's this? It's hard to see, but there's this like a little picture frame here. It needs cleaned up right here, and it's a uh, there's a little baseball in front of this picture frame that was signed by Bob Beller, and it says Hall of Fame '62, and a little Bowman Heritage card. I don't know if that's the autograph version or he signed it, but it's signed by Bob Beller. It looked like there was a sticker there or something. I'll have to clean that up. But that's pretty sweet. A dual signed Bob Veller item. Uh, what else is in here? Oh, I see a bobblehead. So let's pull that out. Uh, yeah, it is. CC Sabathia and Josh Bard. Oh. I'm only signed. Okay. But it's CC Sabathia and Josh Bard. But check this out. Here it is. CC and Josh Bard. But. Boom. Signed by CC. How cool is that? I looked it over to see if it was signed by Josh too, but it's not. That's fine though. CC signed bobblehead. I'll take it. What is that? Oh, there's a piece of paper stuck to it. I thought it was broke. <laughs> okay, so next looks like is nothing. Oh, there's a... What is this? Like a, this is a towel that says Tribe Town. It's kind of dirty from sitting, but tribe town. Ow. I think they use that to keep the baseballs away from everything else, I guess. But there's a, a lot of just random baseballs signed by. I think that one's that. I, I don't know if y'all would be able to see this, but John McDonald, there's just random baseballs in there, and I have no clue who signed what, so I'll have to. This one and this one's even a Jim Tomy photo ball signed by random players. <laughs> so there's that one. We got these uh, what are these like Christmas ornaments? This one looks like Cliff Lee, but it's pretty faded and got some marks on it. But it looks like it's a faded Cliff Lee Christmas ornament signed. It's really hard to see. Uh, we got. Uh, whoever that is, another Christmas ornament signed. And this one is... Uh, it's either Jason or John McDonald. I don't know who he is. But there he is. I think he was like a backup catcher or something. I'm not sure. I keep thinking that's Brandon Phillips, but I'm not for sure. But 
There's that. It's probably not even nowhere near. Who's this one? Oh, I know who this is. I'll see if I can move it around so it'll make it easier. The case is kind of broke. But it's on one of the Indians' photo balls. That looks just like Enar Diaz's autograph. So there's Enar Diaz. A lot of photo balls in here, it looks like. And a lot of people I've never heard of. Who's this one? This is a World's Best Mom Mother's Day 2008 ball. Indian signed by whoever that is. There's going to be a lot of whoever that is baseballs. <laughs> Uh, some of these I heard were game used, but I'm not, or practice used, I'm not sure that he just said they were used. There's this one, signed by God knows who. So if you know your Indians autographs, that would be great. This one's just an, a beat up Omar. Baseball. I think that was a McDonald's deal. This one is one of those, uh, printed printed uh team balls but there's jim jim told me i know this one's not real but it does have let's see if i know earl hershizer's right there even though this one's not real it's still kind of cool carlos Bayerga, eddie murray uh, that's kind of cool looking i know it's not real though that's fine this one is Another Rawlings used, just a used ball. I don't know practice or what, but it's it's hit, been hit pretty well. There's another one. This one is signed by that that might be Sensu Chu. I'm not for sure, but it, that's what it looks like to me. I'll have to check that out. His autograph is always weird. And then we got what's here. Bruce Dreamer, Drennan, I'm not sure on that one, but it does say Bruce Dreamer, Drennan, I'm not sure, if anybody wants to tell me, go ahead, <laughs> just try some of these, I don't know who this is either, but there it is, doesn't have a name, just has the case, so there's that one. Uh, it looks like some of these, some of these have, uh, names on the, like, they wrote the name on the case. This one says, which I would have known this one, but it's in light blue ink there. Or, what, it's in a, on an Indian's photo ball. But it is Johnny Peralta. Sorry if y'all can't see these. There's a lot. This one is No Namer. Official Major League Bowl. Sucks that they're in Sharpie, but uh, see if I can get. There's that one. This is going to be a long video, so stick with me. Please stick with me. This one is. That one kind of looks like it is. It says right there on a photo ball. If you can't read that, it's Ben Broussard, but it is kind of faded. But Ben Broussard signed baseball. Uh, let's keep going. This one is at John McDonald. Like I said, John McDonald. And it looks like there's something on the the way the baseball is sticking to the. That's kind of faded too. John McDonald. This one don't say who it is, but here it is. Uh, let's see what we got going on here with this one. Tony Hamilton, I think it is. That one looks like another game used, I'm not sure. Or practice used, whatever, I don't know. Tony Hamilton. They did a lot of sh running with Sharpies, it looks like. This one is signed. Oh, what's this one? Don, Don Williams. And it's signed over here by... Whoever that is. So there's dual sign with that one. Did say Don Williams on the bottom. Uh, this one says, oh, here we go. This one's easy. Sign, not side panel, but it's Jody Garrett and 
I don't know if that means anything, but it says KCR stamped Major League Baseball. Does anybody know what that means? Oh, we still got lots to go. I might have to make a part two because this is going to take forever. Who's this one? Jack Crescent. Major League Baseball looks used also. But Jack Crescent. Uh, this one says Ryan Ludwig but it's also signed by one two three four other people it's another Indians logo ball it's kind of hard to see the autographs I will have to figure these out because there's a lot uh, this one is Looks like it's also like a practice used ball or something because it's beat up pretty good. But it's Jody Garrett. Oh, the ball starts sliding out of the case. This one says it's uh, side panel. Even says right on it, practice on the baseball. Never seen one of those. I mean, I'm pretty sure people have seen them, but I've never seen one. But it is Kareem Garcia. It says right uh, there, practice. But Kareem Garcia. I know everybody's going to hate that they're Sharpie and everything, but for the price we got for all these, I'm okay with it. One of the, uh, like, team logo balls, and it has your name, the name on it, and it's signed right here, traded, but Jody Garrett. Wow, I still got lots to go. This one is, this one came out really good, a nine... 1997 World Series Baseball. There's the... It's a little dirty. But... World Series Baseball. 97. It says official World Series Baseball. Signed by... Mike Hargrove. So that's pretty sweet. This one is... One of those numbered balls like that Jody Garrett was. But this one's pretty sweet because he... I don't know why there's something pink on the case. <laughs> Let's see if this one will... This one don't even want to move. I don't even, I don't even know what I'm doing. Anyways. It has uh, his name, Travis Hafner, plus his nickname, Pronk, right there. So that's pretty sweet. A nickname, Baseball, signed by Travis Hafner. So that one's pretty cool. <laughs> Who's this one? Uh, this one says Casey Blake. It's just a Rawlings baseball. Casey Blake. That's pretty nice. He was a decent player for our team. Uh, what we got going on here? This one's easy. And another photo ball, but it is Cliff Lee. Oh, still got lots to go. And it's almost time to cut it, I think. This is uh, signed. Uh, I know. Oh, this one's signed by quite a few, but I don't know how they hit. Anyways, this one's Cliff Lee. That one right below the uh, Rawlings is Jeremy Sowers. I don't know who the top one is, but the bottom one's Carl Pavano. I don't, another Major League Baseball. So there's that. Uh, I think I'm going to cut it here, and I'll make a part two. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed. we got many more to go. Looks like there's hopefully some more bigger names. But anyways, we'll see. Thanks for watching. Watch part two. Bye!